What is it guys, Nimrod here and welcome back to another episode of the FIFA 18 career mode. Here he is, Harry Kane, the hurricane, the hot shot again, and he's leading the scoring charts. Watch him go with us and it's last. Well that was fast. <laughs> um anyway, um <clears throat> what uh, yeah, welcome to another episode of the FIFA 18 career mode. Uh, slower now. I always say it faster. I don't know why. Well that's probably because of that animation thing. Um, anyway, today we are facing Liv um, Liverpool. Yep, yeah, that's Liverpool. No, we're facing Spurs today. League leaders. And before this video, I think I talked about it in the finale. I think. Yeah, the finale of the first season. Anyway, um, <clears throat> basically, there was meant to be a video, which was video when we face Arsenal and that was meant to come out before facing Huddersfield or no that was meant to happen in March see now I got a bit too excited and I uploaded it I didn't upload it I uploaded the Man City game which was obviously one we won loads so basically it looks like I'm trying to cut out when we lose but I'm not anyway we lost both games it was Arsenal and someone uh, might have been West Brom, I don't know, but, um, yeah, that was gonna be called, uh, I can't defend, because I can't defend on this game, anyway, we are facing league leaders Spurs, Tottenham Hotspur, and, uh, they have Harry Kane, he's top scorer, that was incredible timing, wow, I didn't even know, <laughs> that was incredible timing, anyway, they have Harry Kane, the top scorer of the Premier League, and last time we faced Tottenham, we drew against them 1 1, and it was just a really fun episode because there was only one game. Well, Tottenham, you're not that special, you have to play two. And I was talking about how Kane was incredible this game. Well, Devi Ali seemed to get on the ball a lot this game, but Tim Krull, who, uh, yep, you saw Tim Krull. I'm replacing Tim Krull with um, Ryan. I've had enough of Ryan, you know. Um, but Tim Crow, yeah, new newcomer into the um, into the team. Anyway, Bellerin makes a really good run and pulls out Loris. Um, Loris pulls out a great save. But yeah, um, the reason why I've replaced Ryan is because he just wasn't having a great um, spout of form. Um, really was not having a good part of form. And look at this, <laughs> Serge Aurier pulls up and he looks like he's in agony. Genuinely, um, pulls his hamstring, it looks like it. But anyway, I am actually contemplating it changing this team to the way it was against. I'm trying to think who it was against. Oh, can't think. Don't remember. Who was it against? Was it Man City? I think it was Man City when we changed it. But then we changed it back and we lost it. I think. No, we didn't. Did we lose? I don't know. Um, anyway, Madeira is obviously... Um, you need to look at this tackle. I mean, this is disgusting for Madeira. It's genuinely... This is a horrible challenge. Probably could break his leg. Look at this. Bang. Jeez, it looks like it absolutely killed. Um, <clears throat> anyway, this... Basically, this game wasn't very exciting. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to you. This game was not very good at all. So, you know, I, I gave you the best bits because I love you guys. But, um, yeah, it was not very good at all. So, um, yeah, uh, uh, why am I showing you this? Oh, feel like I'm showing you this. Just feel like it, you know. Um, <clears throat> Yeah, this is basically what I do. Well, I'm just gonna show you, tell you what I do. Basically, this is what I do if um, you see like um, lots of cheat go up front sometimes. It probably means that um, I've changed the formation to a four one two one two. I do like to do that. Um, uh, yeah, I do like to do that. Uh, Sorry, this is poor commentating. But Chaplin, he's through. Surely he tries to square, and I'm really dumb for doing that, you know. 
Um, yeah, it's really dumb from me. I really shouldn't have done that. Uh, it was an easy chance to score, but I didn't score, so, you know. Oh, well. Um, end of the game. Uh, Tim Crawl played well, though. Tim Crawl played well. This is awful commentating. Sorry, I'm doing something right now. Um, basically, I'm having a mare with my YouTube at the moment. But, Burnley. Burnley versus Brighton. The next, um, um, the next game. And, uh, hopefully, um, <clears throat> hopefully we get a win this game, you know. Um, that was a really poor game against Spurs. Only a few chances, and we, that was actually a chance to get us, um, safe from, um, relegation. Well, this game, uh, wait, did I, was it me getting safe or not? I think a point might have made me safe. I don't know. But, um, we probably had to win against Burnley just to, um, stay safe in the division. And we played Tim Krull again. He actually had a very good game last, um, match. And we played Proper in, and, uh, we push up Gros into the centre forward. And, um, yeah, just to get him more involved into the attacking. Because Gros has played well when he attacks, you know. Scoring, I think he is our top scorer. He could be with like 12 goals, 14, 13, 12, 12, 13, 14. <laughs> but uh, anyway, this was a this was a pretty decent game. Two and Zabe, you know, we're just passing it around um, <clears throat> here. But uh, Sam Vokes gets the ball and he crosses it in, and uh, it's a really good chance for Burnley, um, could have sh um, shoots, but Tim Krull parries it off, and uh, the thing with Tim Krull is he doesn't catch the ball that much, he's not great at catching, anyway, we hit um, Burnley on the counter-attack from that uh, corner, it's really good play from Gross and Loftus-Cheek, Loftus-Cheek plays it to Gross, um, Gross shoots, and uh, I mean, you don't get a better finish than that, what a finish from Gross, Genuinely fantastic. A great counter-attack from um, us. And, uh, yeah, um, lots of cheek as well. Really nice one-two across. Um, <clears throat> basically, um, it's really nice cut inside and then just the finesse into the top corner. Who was in goal? He, he didn't do great there. Let's see if he could. Yeah, Heaton could have done a bit better. Maybe prevented it. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Um, <clears throat> but yeah, Gross gets his eighth goal in the Premier League, but it's like fourteenth or thirteenth for uh, for uh, this season. Anyway, um, it's a really good chance for Gundermanson, um, the Icelandic um, winger. Winger. Yeah, well, yeah. Um, misses though. So, uh, yeah. Sam Vokes plays it to Robbie Brady, who hits the side netting. And we were feeling the pressure, definitely. Um, <clears throat> but Jack Cork plays it to Sam Vokes, and it's missed again. Again, missed from um, um, Burnley. And that's half time. So, half time, um, the score is 1 nil to Brighton um <clears throat> and yeah we were we were having a very good game but so were Burnley it was a really tight match and here's a chance for Barnes again Ashley Barnes missing though um and uh Barnes again plays the ball to Sam Vokes and surely he's gonna finish it well he does it's a good finish from Sam Vokes and Burnley gets on top so 1-1 one, one, and we were feeling the pressure you know we 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 weren't on top at this um, time, you know. Burnley was really doing well. Um, and a great finish from Sam Vokes. Um, <clears throat> finishes it. Bottom corner. Uh, yeah, and it's a, it's a very good finish. Um, I wouldn't mind Sam Vokes. I prefer Chris Wood just because uh, he's... He's just from New Zealand. <laughs> He's just new from New Zealand, you know. Um, and yeah, um, but Barnes has a really good chance. Was that his head or his shoulder? 
I don't know, but Ashley Barnes, because he missed that, he's going off. <laughs> Hendrick comes on, and uh, yeah, Barnes doesn't look the happiest. To be fair, though, if you don't take your chances, you you will get punished, and uh, I've realised that a lot. Um, but Gros um, goes off for uh, Brown, and this is another counter attack for us. Loa Loa gets the ball, and look at this brilliant play from Loa Loa from his own half. Oh, fake shots again. What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Well, he cuts inside and. Tom Heaton, man, you got to finish, um, got to save that, and a brilliant finish from the Wild Wild. And uh, very happy that the Wild Wild got the uh, goal, got the goal. Um, <clears throat> uh, it was a great goal, to be fair. Um, one of the best goals of the season. Maybe I should do a uh, end of season compilation, compilation, compil compilation. Compilation, yeah. Uh, maybe I should do that because, you know, we've done pretty well. Pretty well in DDO. I just said in DDO. Um, <clears throat> but anyway, this is pretty decent. Um, so, Lawa Lawa gets his third goal in the Premier League or second. And he was only here since January. He's been really good, Lawa Lawa, since I've had him. A very fun player to play definitely if you're like a bad what well, no that's really mean um but if you do start with brighton just bring him back in i probably should have done it since the start but uh, i just needed that zing that zing but connor chaplin talking about zing scoring pretty much every goal this season for us um now nah, but knockout plays a beautiful ball Surely this is Connor Chaplin's time, but no, pretty important. Tell me, I'll tell you, that was going in top corner. Um, but anyway, Tim Krull catches the ball and he's ki and he kicks it away. Lost his cheek, um, plays it to Connor Chaplin. Connor Chaplin plays it to uh, Brown. Back to Chaplin, but it's cleared away. And that's the end of the game. So... End of the game, full time, 2-1. Yeah, 2-1. <laughs> Why do I always forget the scoreline? I genuinely have the worst memory of... I have a memory of a fish, yep. Oh, yeah, also, I was thinking of today. Why is a goldfish called goldfish when they're actually, like, orangey? Yeah, I was wondering that. Anyway, Scarapot. <laughs> they probably are gold, it's just my ones aren't. Um, Scarapot. Yeah, just orgasming over that uh, goalkeeper, uh, even though that's not him. Where is he? Yeah, there he is. Yeah, there he is, Oliver Baker. Jeez. Six foot six. Massive. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy them, please do subscribe and leave a like while you're at it. And follow my Twitter at Nimrod underscore 742. And I will see you later. Goodbye.